Hi and welcome to day one of 100 Days of Swift. I almost forgot what it's called. Uh, having a bit of fun here with the playground. So I just booted up Xcode and it says getting started. So get started with playground. And I'll show you that again. It's a bit quick. There we go. Getting started with playground. And we're going to learn about variables. Blank is a great place to start. Save it on the desktop. Press create. Had a bit of fun with this before, it crashed. Uh, so <laughs> just when you want to do the first day. <laughs> so here you just press the play and it'll build it. And over the side, it shows you that I've stored a string into this variable called str. And if I want to change it, str will equal something else. So I'll put, hello everyone. And then build again and there's hello everyone. It actually automatically builds down here if you hold it down with your mouse and then go automatically run, it'll just build it every time you change it. So let's make another variable, we're gonna make it a number. So I'm gonna make it my age, um, whoops, not like that, age equals and I'm 40. And as you can see, it built automatically to the side there and to change that, we just go age equals 41. And sometimes you get, see there's an error there because it was trying to build it while I was changing it. So don't worry about that. And also let's create, so when you create your variable, you give them names so you can help remember what they are later in your code. So we're gonna go age string. I'm gonna just call str for string, age string, and put in there 41, and it's automatically building. Don't worry about the errors as you type. Wait till the end when you stop typing, and that will be what you have. There you go, so that's how to create variables.